uh, a demonstration. This is a MHL enabled TV. This is an MHL enabled phone, both of which you can go uh, access and buy on the market. And this is a, an MHL cable acting from the phone into the TV. And this is your typical phone display. Now it's replicated on the, on the TV screen. And what we have done is put together a, a demonstration environment using the tools uh, with, uh, within MHL. Let's see. Okay, so uh, this is my, I'm using the TV remote control and I'm uh, uh, working through the menu on the uh, phone. So what, what's, what's a, the control path is through the TV, through the MHL protocol and uh, controlling the display device, display on the TV, uh, on the phone, then that display, the phone is actually driving the display on this TV. So we'll go into the gallery on the phone. So these are pictures that we have on the phone. Let's see if I can understand the highlighting here. So I happen to have shot the video clip. This is a clip I took, um, took by myself or I downloaded to my phone or I'm streaming from the streaming over LTE. So content's coming from the phone and of course that's my set-top box. Controlling my set-top box through uh, my TV remote control. <laughs> yes, this is all live. Uh, the content stored on the phone is not live download, but it's live control and live streaming. Well, you guys uh, never played Angry Birds, so. <laughs> what? <laughs> after all, after all that, well, I had played once or twice. But. <laughs> you understand what? <laughs> So uh, it, one of the things that will, this enables is a whole new set of, you know, right now the, the application designers are limited to this screen space, but now there's just a whole different palette that needs to be dealt with. Not just the UI, but also the gameplay can be, now you can design games for serious gamers. Uh, you can also use the mouse, if I use the mouse here. Uh, is the acceleration of this thing is killing me. <laughs> All right, I'm just going to use this. So you can you can use the control on either side. Um, but what I was saying is that uh, there's all you can now do develop serious games for serious gamers on the phone and drive it out to your TV. You're not just limited by uh, by the small screen space. And you, you could design the, the application could use the remote control as the game controller. Yeah, yeah that's right. You could, you could use this as a game controller. You could use a different device as a game controller. It could either be IR or it could be Bluetooth to the phone. I saw the demo and it looked pretty good. Can you give a few words, like if you are sitting next to a monitor, how it looks like compared to a computer monitor? Quality, Qual quality would be uh, uh, similar. Uh, it's. Uh, it's not really a lot to do with distance, I guess. I guess number of pixels would be different, I guess. Yeah, if you go to higher, higher resolutions, this is all 1080p. If you go to higher resolutions, then you, you, this does, uh, of course, you know, if you look at standards, they evolve. But uh, today, that's, that's what the standard is. So MHL 2 did not have any additional pixels over MHL 1. The feature, yeah, it did not increase the number of pixels, it increased the feature set. <coughs> and you couldn't do this with the HDMI, except the power issue. Yeah, you power, form factor, uh, various kinds of control, yeah, there are a number of differences. How much soft? 
software is there above the link layer? Is it like USB, a lot of, lot of drivers, a lot of stacks? Uh, you can think of it as more of a hardware-driven interface. There are definitely layer two kinds of functions that, that are in the software. So what I'll try and do here is uh, bring up uh, something to enter some data into. Oh, I guess not that one. <laughs> Travel account. This one? No. We just used one with zero bytes. Oh, zero bytes. We were using one before. Oh, I see. Yeah, thanks. Let's try this one. I wouldn't use 9.4. So this again is coming off the phone. I guess this is just. Yeah. Again, I haven't. Uh, I was looking for an XLS actually. This is a 1.0 spec, not 3.0. Uh, this uh, is an MHL2, but um, I don't believe, don't believe this device uh, actually supports any 3D, or at least we don't have any 3D demonstration. Okay, I guess you just typed hello. <laughs> so this is a keyboard entry going, going on your phone. Okay, I'll shoot the image like the most